Welcome to this tutorial on how to add color to a black and white photo in Corel Paint Shop Pro. Adding color to black and white images is anything but recent. In fact, some of the earliest application of colorization was done by Thomas Edison and involved painting dyes onto the emulsion. In this tutorial, we will show you a similar but much less messy version of Edison's technique that you'll be simply dying to try out for yourself. First, launch Paint Shop Pro and make sure that the Edit tab is active. Next, open the image that you'll be working with. From the Layers menu, select Create New Raster Layer. Since this project contains multiple layers, go to the File menu and select Save As. Save your project as a PSP image file. This way, your layers will remain intact and the original image will be preserved. For the remainder of this tutorial, you'll need to have the layers and the materials palettes open. If these palettes are not visible, click on the F8 and F6 keys on your keyboard respectively to launch them. From the layers palette, select the new raster layer that you've just created. And then, from the blend mode drop-down list, select color legacy. Next, select the paintbrush tool from the standard toolbar. You can adjust the size of the paintbrush in the interactive properties bar at the top of the screen. Choose a color that you think best represents your subject. In this example, I'll be using many different colors and blending them together. First, I'll begin with the skin tone. After selecting the color, you can add it to the color palette for later use. This is helpful when working with a complex image like this one, as you may miss a spot and have to do further touch-ups as you go. To add a color swatch, click on the Swatches tab in the Materials palette and then click on the Create New Swatch icon. You can give the swatch a name, such as Skin Tone 1, and then click OK. As you paint over your subject, you can change the amount of color or the density by adjusting the opacity in the interactive properties bar. This is helpful when adding blush to a face or blending the various shades of green on foliage. When adding color to a photo that was originally shot in black and white, some level of artistic license is expected. In this example, we know that the leaves are green and that dandelions are yellow, but eye color, makeup, and the color of the beads on her necklace are guesswork. Depending on the complexity of the image, it's not uncommon for the procedure to take a long time, so patience is key and make sure to save often so that you don't lose your work. When the project is complete, go to File, Save As, and select JPEG. You will get a warning, and this is because a JPEG can only contain a single layer. Click Yes to this message to continue and your layers will become merged into one color photograph. And no need for any messy dyes or spilled ink bottles. Thank you for watching this video on how to add color to a black and white photograph using Corel Paint Shop Pro.